I can do this now in front of you guys. Uh, my face cam is going to be a lot better. But we are back at it again. Yeah, boy, this is your boy, Barbecue Chief, back at it. Playing some Fortnite and giving out Super Bowl predictions a week early. So let's get into a game and we'll talk about it. If you see I'm using a drink, I'm just using those kind of stuff to drink or try to throw it down. Keep my coughing down for a little bit. It's getting into the game, that's for sure. It takes a while for it to load into the game, so be ready for it. Old log screens, that's for sure. It's being slow. There, it just jumped us into the battle bus. That's fine with me. We're gonna go. Now, we'll go to. to no, I'm late. It's fine. <coughs> so, I'll start off when I get to the place I'm going to here. I don't have much to play for now. <laughs> there are bots after the game. Some of you just realize that, but I won't judge you for it. But let me kind of get in to. Yeah, I know you guys are going to screw over me, but I don't care. So, Super Bowl predictions a week early. My roommate, I'm just going to say, roommate Zach Jones, used to be a football player for Warburg Football, is predicting that the 49ers win by three, one if by a field goal. 24 to 21 and I predict uh, I the Chiefs win <coughs> by 7 35 to 28 like I predicted in the championship round and it was so close to being that which completely confuses me how that was almost the thing but I'll have to get used to that Dang it. <coughs> I 
Can I upgrade a few things here? On this circle, I don't have to worry about it much. But. As I said, my prediction is Chiefs win it by 7 30. I didn't say score. 35 to 28 final score. I think they bring the trophy back to Kansas City and they're going to have to fight for it because that defense is getting to it. Defense of the 49ers has a good front line <coughs> with Nick Bosa. And y'all know son or er, brother of Joey Bosa. I'm the wrong thing. <coughs> brother of Joey Bosa, who is uh, probably never going to be in the AFC Championship game. I was going to predict that. Even though people predict it's going to be completely different. Okay. <coughs> this 49ers team with Joey Bosa and that front line that in former Chief D Ford, honestly, former Seahawk D Ford, Richard Sherman, they have bulked up that defense like crazy. It has been something that, that teams have been hurt by so much this year. Not many people have been able to. <sighs> One fifty. That seems weird. Do say. But I. People say, oh, the 49ers will win by so much. Yeah, I haven't seen... I watched the 49ers play a few bit, but not all the time. They do have some time to reevaluate some of the stuff. Their offense is going to have to compete with our offense of the Kansas City Chiefs. And they have been, they both have been doing very well. The Chiefs won by 11 last week to the Titans, against the Titans. <coughs> and the 49ers won by 17, 37 to 20 over the Packers. And the Chiefs won 35, 24. Against the Titans. Yes, I get it. I'm predicting another same score kind of thing. <coughs> but I really think it's going to happen. They have a good offense. And we have a good offense. But that defense is probably what's going to shut us down. I'm already going to say it. The Chiefs still win by 7. And they get off to a great start. Is my prediction completely? And uh, people say this Chiefs team was lucky through to, uh, the playoffs. Actually, we've been known to make comebacks. I think Mahomes last year kind of showed that against in a Monday Night Football game against the Denver Broncos. Who are a lot better than they were this year. <coughs> well, they definitely did not show it this year. And I know they definitely have some good talent. 
this Chiefs has a good, talented team coming into this game. They have Tyree Kill, Sammy Watkins. Most of those guys are healthy and ready to go. Travis Kelsey was out Thursday with sickness, but I'm hoping he's good to go for this week. This Chiefs team has been up and down the season with injuries and other stuff. And just to see them where they're at now is good to be in that position. Because, yes, I get it. They were at the lowest point in their season when they lost Pat Mahomes. Even though they went 1-1 one one before Mahomes came back. And you can't say that our backup can't run against the person. I mean, he did well against Aaron Rodgers, even though they lost. I get that. But this 49ers team, Jimmy Garoppolo, back up to Tom Brady at the start, uh, two years ago. Did horrible last year. Were the second pick last year. And ended up becoming a Super Bowl champ this year, or a Super Bowl contender this year, which is cool to see. <coughs> yeah, I'm not counting the Chiefs out. I know people want to say, oh, but the Chiefs won't win. They don't have a team to beat that offense of San Francisco. I mean, if you watch the last three weeks, we've had a chance, we've all, we won all three games. Defense has stepped up, offense has stepped up. And you expect me to say the 49ers win? You're a crazy son of a gun if you think. That's my thought. Yes, I know bias with the Chiefs team. It was the Chiefs team that's really good. I honestly don't care anymore. <sighs> Four kills in the game, I'm happy. But back to the main reason of this video. The Chiefs have had a good season this year. I get that people say, oh, bias, bias, bias. Well, I'm going to say it only by seven. Because that defense was probably going to shut down that old line of the Kansas City Chiefs. That has been a problem the last two or three weeks. But it has definitely been stronger and stronger. <coughs> People say, well, Pat Mahomes is going to get injured somehow. Yeah, I don't think so. People know how to really make people mad. Looking at stories this week. The thing that makes me the most mad is that people try to say, oh, well, you can go this person, this person, this person. I mean, yeah. <sighs> Hasn't been the best for me, I get that. 
But this Chiefs team will win this Super Bowl and take it back to Kansas City. It's definitely something I'm going to wait to see and watch. And you definitely are going to want to watch it next week. I'm watching it next week. I just don't know where yet. <coughs> and would love to see this team go completely haywire against a team that, oh, they're a good defense. Oh, they're a good offense. Yeah, I don't care anymore because people definitely don't know what is on the table for the Kansas City Chiefs. It's been 50 years for Kansas City. And yes, I say they win by 7. This Chiefs team is a lot different than 07, 15, where they lose in the divisional round, and 16. Like they, or, yeah, where they lose in the divisional round, win in the wild card round in 15. I mean, they could have gone farther, but these last three years, they have been good. So, count your predictions down below. Make sure you like this video, hit that subscribe button, and bell icon so you get notified when my videos come up. See ya.